So, as this video says, the question is, why is my FPS in Microsoft 2024 locked to 60 FPS? So, it's been a while since I recorded any video in the same, or even been in the same. To be honest with you, it has just, I've just been sick to death of it. Every time I log into it, I gotta tweak something, I gotta adjust something, something's not working, something's crashing. And I'm sick to death of trying to tweak everything before I can even fly anything. Today was no exception. When I opened up the sim today, all of a sudden I get all these pop-ups as if it was the first time I ever opened the sim. And it went through career thing. It went through a couple of things. And I was going, the hell, man? What, why is it asking me all these questions when I set them all before? Then I thought, oh, holy crap. That means that... If it's asking me these, it's changed all my default settings. And lo and behold, yes it has. Because when I'm sitting at the login screen, the last time I shut it down, I was getting 110, around 110 FPS at the login screen. Now it goes from 60, drops down to 10. I was thinking, oh, what the hell, man? They've done something, haven't they? They've done something in the background. And... When I went to go into a test flight, into free flight, and picked normal one that I do a test flight in New York. Normally just jump in here around the um, Zoom in the helipad at Manhattan. What I did notice, I noticed a lot more sounds were going on. I was thinking, hold on a second, I didn't hear those sounds before. I've turned them down at the moment to stop it annoying the crap out of everybody. But as I was sitting here just waiting to load in, I was hearing sounds. When I went into the helicopter, sounds were a lot louder. What I realized was, when I go to settings, I realized first of all, why is the FPS so bad? It was stuck at 60 FPS. I was getting over 100 FPS before on Ultra. And then I realized I was getting 100 FPS on Ultra at 4K. I'm not on a 2K. I realized, wait a minute, V-Sync is on. And I turned V-Sync off because I had frame gen turned on. So I turned that on. Okay, presto, our FPS is back up. Also, dynamic settings magically is turned back on again. Don't want that. Turn that off. So... If they've changed those two settings, I had them set. Then the sounds as well. The sounds were all up at 100%. I adjusted them back down. The music was back on. That stupid music that annoys the crap out of me. The environment was on. Sorry, not the environment, the user interface. All those little clicky, whistly things. Turn that off. So I was thinking... I've adjusted all those back up again. What's this? What's the odds that if I go into flight interface, yep, landmarks are back on, and city marks, and airport marks, show flight plan, all this crap that I don't want on. So we turn that off again. That means that assistance, yep, they've turned on the assistance as well. I don't want these on. And Wake Turbulence, which is the killer on any multiplayer 2024, is back on again, so we'll turn that off. So now here we go back into New York on Ultra. Our FPS is back up again in the 80s. I'll probably get it up even higher if I switch it back down. 
not fly everything in ultra try it in high end yeah we're back up to over 100 in high end so that's what's happened microsoft in their great wisdom have done something on their servers that's okay update the cloud servers i don't mind but leave my local flipping settings in the server in my sim alone don't keep changing the back to default things and when i go in everything has gone to crap fps has dropped down to flipping nothing all the points of interest are back on that i don't want so hopefully if anybody else is having that problem and you're wondering why the hell has my fps dropped to 60 and locked on 60 odds are microsoft have gone in and turned all the default crap back on again that you turned off to get your sim working so just go back in do all your configurations again and you should be back up and working the way you were don't ask me why they keep doing this this has happened to me multiple times before and i wish we had somewhere that you could just click a save all your configurations that you could restore them but you can't but hopefully that's helped a few people who are scratching their head going what the hell why my fps dropped and um yeah we'll leave it at that and i will chat to you later any questions or anything as always drop them in the comments below and i'll get back to you but now that we have it back i need to get flying again and do a few more videos on a few add-ins that i'm gonna purchase but for now we'll leave it at that we're back up at 128 fps and things are happy for the moment Okay, chat to you later. Bye.